agents swarm Wausau City Hall. Tonight, the State Justice Department now taking over a criminal investigation into Wausau's mayor after he moved the city's ballot drop box into his office. 12 News Political Director Matt Smith breaking the story statewide today. Matt, city officials tonight being urged to cooperate. In a story, Deanna receiving national attention, new political feuds forming at this hour tonight as the Justice Department is now investigating the removal of the city's ballot drop box. Tonight, the criminal investigation targeting Wassa Mayor Doug Denny quickly intensifying. Sources confirming to 12 News at least a half dozen Department of Justice agents inside City Hall today, now taking over the investigation into potential election interference. I thought the mayor acted outrageously uh, to do it on a Sunday and to brag about it. Denny taking a photo and moving the city's ballot drop box into his office, concerned it wasn't secure, prompting a week-long standoff between the new mayor and city clerk. The mayor with us Monday, just moments after the drop box was returned and moved back outside. There's an investigation, a sheriff's department nearby is investigating. Is that still going to play out, do you think? Uh, that I, I don't know that's going to be up to up to them, but I don't, I don't see any criminal intent here. There's nothing really... You know, the, again, the box is in the charge of the clerk. Wausau's Common Council president sending an email to city employees this morning obtained by 12 News saying, I just became aware that DCI agents are at City Hall to investigate the matter surrounding the ballot drop box. As council president, I am requesting that you cooperate with the investigation as we would with any criminal investigation. This includes allowing access to or providing public records if requested. Did you imagine this would receive the attention it did when, when you moved it a, a week ago? You know, the 15 minutes of fame isn't all it's cracked up to be, uh, to be honest with you. No, I, I didn't. Uh, I, as, a, as it originally happened, it was unsecure. I brought it in, took a little photo. I sent it to the, uh, the council president who ended up sending it out there. It went viral, quite a crazy mm -hmm. uh, event. Viral, now a national story like yeah. you mentioned, Matt. Tonight, the mayor is responding to you. As this criminal investigation is still ongoing tonight, claiming as of this afternoon, the mayor had not met with DCI agents and going on and going after the council president, saying to me in an email, she is completely outside of her authority to direct or speak on behalf of the city or put out information for self-serving purposes. Rasmussen clearly doesn't have enough to do at her State Farm agency job. If she wanted to be mayor, she should consider running in 2028. Also today, a group of residents now asking federal agents and federal agents to investigate this as well. Okay, and you'll stay on top of the investigation. Matt Smith, thank you.